love for reading. South Hills Middle School in Twin Falls has a mission to get more students reading, and they're doing it with the help of a vending machine. It is such a neat idea. Our Shira Matsuzawa introduces us to the people behind this, this week's Innovative Educator. At South Hills Middle School, this is not your typical vending machine. Rather than dispensing chips, candy, or Coke, this machine is vending a love for reading. So it started with uh, an idea one of my reading teachers had, and she saw it at just published in other schools. And so her and my library uh, librarian got together. Principal Sarah Pregitzer says the vending machine arrived over the summer. And so what we use it for are rewards. Um, some of our students earn different tickets for what we call PBIS, and that's um, positive behavior of interventions and supports. And then our librarian also monthly um, has the kids come down for their birthdays and they get a token and they get a book for their birthday. That librarian is Whitney Moses. I want all students to have books in their home. I we can have a we have a lovely library here with almost 11,000 books for students, but that doesn't always mean that they have easy access to books. The students get a ticket for good behavior. The ticket is then traded in for a token to be used in the machine to get a book. And so our students will come in and see what new books our librarian has stocked um, the vending machine with. Um, they look at different books and say, oh, this is the one I want for my birthday, or this is the one I'm going to add up to with all my tickets to try to get a token with it. And it's not just a fun reward, but also helping turn a page in each child's chapter of development. One of our school goals is to increase our rating scores. And so with that, um, we're kind of using this to coincide with it and help support that goal. It's when I see students gathered outside of the book vending machine, pointing to the books like, oh, they have that book, I'm gonna get that book. Um, that is really gratifying for me as a librarian to see their enthusiasm for reading and that it's something that is motivating for them that they're excited to get that book. And there's a whole variety of books to choose from. We're trying to get as many books into kids' hands as we possibly can and we really want to put books in that vending machine that are super appealing to students. So you'll see the, like graphic novels, Diary of a Wimpy Kid, some classics of literature, but mostly we're really looking at things that would be on the, on the bestseller list. Sarah Pregitzer and Whitney Moses, Innovative Educators. And get this, that vending machine has already given out more than 200 books. Whoa. Both Sarah and Whitney credit another teacher who was with the school previously for this idea, but she has since moved on to California. Now, if you would like to nominate an innovative educator who is going above and beyond, just send us an email yes. to innovativeeducator at ktvb.com. Now, educators, for information on submitting an application for a classroom grant through the CapEd Idaho Foundation as well, yeah, we have a link if you can do that. Yeah. Uh, at the story, ktvb.com, you can get money for projects in your classroom. Really great idea there.